leucine, isoleucine. These are the three branch chain amino acids, or BCAAs. Iso means same or equal. Isoleucine and leucine have the same molecular weights, the same size, but they have different shapes. And the shapes has impact on things like the protein folding. So in isoleucine and in valine, the branch is close to the backbone, which makes it hard for the backbone to rotate and is therefore going to restrict where these amino acids can be located inside of proteins. Not only do these all have branches in their chains, their side chains, but they actually all go through the same breakdown process. They use this complex called the branched chain alpha keto acid dehydrogenase complex, or BCKD. And you might be wondering, well, what happened to the amino part? Well, there's a transaminase that takes off the amino part, and that's why we go from branched chain amino acids to branched chain alpha keto acids. Mutations in different parts of the complex can all cause this disorder called MSUD or a maple syrup urine disease. This complex and this process is very, very similar to alpha keto acid dehydrogenase complexes for things like pyruvate. They actually use some of the same subunits, like this E3 subunit. If you have mutations, then it prevents the breakdown of these branch chain amino acids. Then they're going to build up. It's going to compete for the large neutral amino acid transporters in your brain. So those LNAAs. And what's going to happen then is that those amino acids that need to get into your brain can't get into your brain because they're being hogged by things like the leucine. The leucine especially is really good at competing to try to get into the brain. And so the leucine is going to get in your brain, but then the other amino acids that need to get into there, like the tyrosine and things, are going to have some trouble. And that's going to make it so your brain can't make hormones and things that it needs. Additionally, you get these side products build up. And so one of the spontaneous side products is sodalone, which smells like maple syrup. And so then parents might be like, why does this diaper smell like syrup? It smells good, but that's not good because it's not good because it's indicating you have this buildup of these branched chain amino acids. Additionally, these branched chain amino acids can serve as signaling molecules for your body to kind of indicate its fed status. And so they activate this mTOR pathway, which then leads to growth and insulin secretion and things that if not controlled can be bad. Most of the breakdown happens in the muscles and things and not in the liver, even though liver does most of the metabolizing of all sorts of stuff.